Hello, my name is Mark with a C and here's something you probably may or may not know about me in one minute or less. Back in 2012-ish, I used to draw pet cartoons of people's pets for their crazy requests through an online website. My cartoonist name was actually Mark Paws and it was pretty cool. I had a logo, it wasn't even my face, it was a cartoon of my me as the cartoonist. My cartoonist name was actually Mark Paws, as in Paws. I used to sign it Mark with a K and put a couple of little paws and Sharpie. I used to number them. I doodled out whatever they asked me to doodle out. They would digitally send me pictures of their pets and come up with these crazy requests like, I want my pit bull on a scooter wearing a Pittsburgh Steelers helmet, something like that. And then I'd just doodle it away. I would color it in with Sharpies. I'd put it in a secure envelope so it wouldn't bend or get ruined. So it was a real work of art, y'all. I'll show you in a sec. And that was it. I would send it off to them, but I scanned every one I did. I think I did about 500 of them in total before I got sick of doodling people's pets and their crazy requests. This is a great example of you think you like something and then once you do it a ton, you're like, I don't want to draw another pet in my life. And also that kind of thing is not scalable. I mean, I could have hired cartoonists and stuff. But that's a management nightmare. And really it's not, it was kind of like a passion project. I just wanted to share that with you. So would you like to see a couple of works of art from back then? Here we go. Poof. Okay, here we go. This is one number 75. There it is, 2012. You see my little autograph with the paws, Mark Paws. I had a little cartoon face, which was not me. A cartoon face of me as the cartoonist. Hmm, how funny. And this one was an awesome request. I love this one because if you've seen The Big Lebowski, this client wanted his dog. He sent a digital picture of his dog and kind of looks like his dog. And it was in the sweater of the Big Lebowski, the dude. If you saw the movie, you know what I'm talking about. The dog abides. It was always the dude abides. I don't have to explain it all. The dude liked white Russians. This allowed me to kind of unleash my creativity. It was an outlet for my creativity. I'll show you another quick one since I think we're under the minute. There's one where the client sent me his two cute little white doggies and he wanted them in a red Mustang convertible. So there you have it. As you can see, I am not a professional artist. I'm not even a professional cartoonist. I just like to doodle. Or should I say liked to doodle. After 507, I think, 507 of those and the requests kept coming in. I kept putting up the price, you know, their originals, and I just didn't want to do it anymore, so I stopped. But there you have it. Something you probably did not know about me. In 2012, I was known as Mark Paws. The website was Anything Is Possible, P-A-W, and people would go on the website, put in their crazy requests, upload their pet's pictures, make a payment through PayPal, and this guy, would doodle all day long. And there you have it. Have a great day. Bye-bye now.